Hi, my name is Hilary Waters Vale, and I'm an artist working with textile processes and botanical material. My art's been exhibited around the world and has been featured in publications by the New York Botanical Garden and the University of Helsinki. It's also been included in The Guardian, The Observer, The Sunday Times South Africa, Embroidery Magazine, and Buffalo Spree Magazine. Although I have a background in textiles and embroidery, the first time I ever stitched on a leaf, it felt different. Using these materials and processes was a way for me to connect my desire to protect our environment with the art I was making. Working with leaves and embroidery is a way for me to connect nature in the human hand and to celebrate what's possible when we act gently and with care. During my creative process, I try to be very respectful of the plants that I'm taking leaves from. There's a real magic in pushing a material past our expectations of its physical limitation. Creating this magic and cultivating a sense of wonder is really what's at the heart of my work. In this Domestica course, you'll learn the basics of embroidery and how to stitch onto non-traditional materials. For the final project, you'll create a design and embroider it onto a non-traditional or unexpected material. First, I'll introduce you to the history and styles of embroidery, and then I'll help you choose a material that's meaningful for you. I'll then teach you a few basic stitches to get started. Once our workspace is ready, we'll sketch our ideas and prepare our materials. Next, I'll show you two ways to transfer your design. Afterwards, we'll pick our colors and start stitching. Last of all, I'll show you what to do once it's done. By the end of this course, you'll hopefully think differently about the materials that you use and be ready to explore them in combination with new needlework techniques. You'll need drawing materials, tracing or graph paper, low adhesive tape, an awl, and of course, thread and needles. Find your message and voice and stitch the unexpected.